When adding voiceovers to a mix, there's one rule, which is the voiceover needs to be put on top of a music clip or a transition clip. It can't just be by itself. So if we go to voiceovers and we find the one we want, we drag it onto the eight count sheet. If you try to preview it, it's gonna give you an error. And what that really means is there needs to be something behind it. It can't just be an acapella voiceover. So you could go to like the transitions category, it's the easiest way, and just grab a transition. Throw that right behind there, and now you can preview the voiceover, and it'll have some music behind it. We know you heard the stories, we have you all in fear. It's better than putting it on top of a music clip. If you dump it on top of a song, there's a really good chance that your voiceover vocals are going to clash with the song's vocals, because most of the songs in here don't have instrumental parts. So, I highly encourage everybody that when you do your voiceovers, use these transitional backgrounds. There's a whole bunch of them, so you can get all different types of energy and styles, and honestly, in custom music, that's how we do it as well. So that's how you add voiceovers to a count mix.